Hello friends, welcome back. Today we are going to see a uh, top three questions which frequently asked by multiple uh, subscriber. Okay, so let's see today that in EC2 uh, category, EC2 uh, services. Okay, so let's see what those question and what we are going to cover today. Okay, so here is those questions. How to increase EC2 service quota? That's the number one uh, multiple uh, subscriber asked me in the comment section. Uh, the second question is, do we have quotas for other AWS services also? And the last one is facing issue while sending email over port 25 uh, using uh, from my EC2 instance uh, and AWS Lambda function. Okay, so this uh, three uh, thing we are going to cover today in this AWS EC2 troubleshooting series. Okay, and if you new to this channel, please go ahead and hit subscribe button. And if you like this video, then stay tuned on this channel for multiple upcoming troubleshooting videos and daily hacks. Okay, so let's start. Okay, so let's see the first question, how to increase EC2 service quota, okay. So let's first uh, try to understand what is AWS service quota, okay. So is the quota is not only for EC2, it is for all AWS services and it is a region basis, okay. So basically uh, we can uh, give the other name, uh, alternate name as the AWS limits. Okay, so once you log in into your AWS console, you can either go out here and click on my service quota go to account section click on Mars my service quota here you can see all the service quota which you are currently having on your AWS account so basically uh, this quota uh, this including uh, your EC2 images uh, volume snapshot Okay, when you create AWS account, uh, by default, some quota is assigned to your account. Okay, it is based on the region, based on the what type of account you have. Okay, so let's see here. Let's go back, uh, see the EC2 now. Okay, so let me go here on the EC2 and let's see what, how much I have quota on EC2. Okay, so by default, uh, this quota is assigned to your account. So you need to increase that. Okay, so see here, I have launch configuration uh, 200, auto scaling group 200, and rest I not have any quota. There are multiple pages. You can go uh, service by service, okay. Reserve instance, I have only 20 quota, okay. So how to increase the quota limit, okay. The question is how to increase the quota limit. Okay, so let's see here uh, if I want to go for reserve instance. Okay, I have only 20 uh, numbers of EC2 instance which I can reserve. So I want to increase uh, this quota. Okay, so simply select this option whichever you want to increase and here you can see request limit increase. Okay, so simply click out here. So what it will do, it will go to your support page and it will create a case, okay. So select what you want to increase, okay, and add the type, uh, region which you, uh, uh, which region you want to increase, add your request and click on submit. So once we, once you submit, okay, then uh, you will get email from AWS and based on that your service quota will increase. Okay, so you can see here, once you go to create case, there are three options, account and billing, service limit increase and technical support. So whenever you have any uh, issue or troubleshoot you require further assistance, you may go to technical support. Okay, but uh, increasing the limit, there is an option, service limit increase. Okay, so use this option. Okay, so let's see again our questions how to increase service quota okay so we seen how to increase this is done let's move again next question do we have quota for other aws services also yes we do have quota for other aws services also so let's go ahead and click on my service quota 
okay so apart from ec2 you can see here all other services this is the by default quota okay if you open a new aws account okay so this is a by, w, uh, by default quota per region so my region is us east to ohio yeah us to uh, us is to ohio and this is my service quota accordingly the, you may open a request to any region it depends upon that region you will get a service quota okay so our second question is done now let's move to the third question okay so our third question is facing facing issue while sending email over port 25 from my ec2 instance and aws lambda functions okay so now you guys seen my multiple videos okay i continuously saying that port 25 is by default block on your all ec2 instance okay so you cannot use that port okay that is by default block so you need to request to aws to open that port so basically in order to maintain the quality of uh, aws ec2 instance okay uh, the port 25 basically it's uh, blocked by default okay uh, so how to enable that okay so let's see again here okay so come down here in the support section click on the support center okay and here we can type remove port 25 okay so yeah see here if you type uh, port 25 also you will get this form okay so click on here and okay uh, now you can see here uh, how do i remove the restriction on port 25 okay so see here go ahead and request this form okay type your email address okay type your uh, case description provide your uh, elastic ip or dns it is optional and go ahead and click on submit once you submit then your ec2 instance uh, will get port 25 remove automatically okay so let's summarize what we did so far okay so we seen how to increase ec2 service quota we have seen apart from ec2 any other services also have quota okay and what we seen uh, port 25 is by default block on ec2 instance how to enable that okay so these three things we seen this is the day-to-day -day issues the operation engineers uh, might face this on daily basis okay so this is a, a good video for those people uh, who's uh, supporting the cloud infrastructure okay if you like this video then give one big thumbs up we'll see you next week with another uh, troubleshooting video on new topic okay if you have any questions please let me know in the comment section i will try to give answer uh, like this while creating video okay that's it for today bye bye